Hey, what's up? My name is Andre, and this is my C++ tutorial about the forward declarations. So the whole goal of that is to make our compile time as fast as possible. And to do that, we want to have the least amount of code possible in our he header files. And in this case, you can see that I'm using this map tile header and I have the include of animal header. And right now I'm only using the animal objects for a parameter to a certain function and for a return type. And the thing with for declarations is whenever you are not using the variable on a f or a functions of a certain object, but you're just saying that this exists and you're giving it a type of pointer or a reference, which is pretty much the same, then the compiler can already guess the size and you don't need to include the whole file, but just tell it in the header file that, hey, there's such an object called animal. And that's it. And also, I have the enum from this class. And some people don't know that, but you can also for declare enums. The only thing is, you also need to say what is the size of the enum because the compiler cannot guess that. So we are just writing enum e animal type, and we are saying it's a type of char, which means a size of char, which means one byte in this case. And pretty much this way, I removed my include from the header file. And the only thing left to do is just to add the include in the CPP file. And this way, whenever you are including this map tile header, you are only including the vector in my case. And you don't need to include the whole animal file. And therefore, the compilation time of that will be faster. And if you do that in, let's say, most of your files, you can see, a, let's say, a bigger difference in your compilation time than before because you have way less code, I mean, depending on your project. And this is a huge game changer if you haven't been doing that before. So I hope you learned something from that and I see you in the next one.